Welcome to Stafford Audi. Today I'd like to show you this 2019 on a 19 plate Audi Q7 Black Edition 50 TDI Quattro with a Tiptronic gearbox. This vehicle is presented to you today in Orca Black Metallic and is available now at Stafford Audi. For more details or for a finance quote, please contact us now on 01785 899 417 and we'll be happy to assist you. Now looking around at the front of this Q7 here, you can see these very bright LED headlights along with the front parking sensors. Part of the Black Edition specification also means that this vehicle comes equipped with a black grille surround and black window surrounds as well. Now the Q7 looks very striking and aggressive from the front with that large front grille being a signature of Audi. Now if we come round to the front, you can have a look at the 21 inch alloy wheels. Now coming round to the front end of the Q7, as previously mentioned, this vehicle does have 21 inch alloy wheels, which are a five twin spoke design Audi Sport alloy wheel in a titanium look. Now these are very suited to this vehicle. They are also part of the black edition package and are an optional extra on this vehicle. Now coming back out from the car, you can see the roof rails on this vehicle, allowing you to put a roof box or bikes or other large items on the roof of this vehicle if you're taking your family away for a weekend break. And you can also see the gloss black surrounds from the windows. This is part of the Black Edition trim. And this vehicle, being an S-Line based vehicle, does also come with the S-Line front and rear bumpers and also has a very aggressive stance. Now, as you can see also, this vehicle is an SUV. And speaking of it being an SUV, you also get that added practicality in the back of the car with these reclinable rear seats. And there is also that foldable center armrest there with cup holders. Now, it's a very large vehicle, so there's plenty of space in the back of the car for people well over six foot. And this panoramic sunroof really lets in the light. There is also nets on the back of the seats. Now stepping away to the rear three quarters of the vehicle, you can see how much the privacy glass ties in with the Orca black metallic paintwork. And you can also see the LED rear lights, meaning that you remain visible in all weather conditions. Now if we come round to the centre rear of this vehicle, you can see the twin quad exhaust tips and the very sleek design of this SUV. Now there are three ways of opening the boot. You can either do it on the key fob, you can do it from inside the cot, or you can also do it, as I'm going to do in a second, by pulling on the little button underneath the Audi badge there, which means that it's easy to get your shopping in and out or any other larger items that you may have, as you don't need to lift the tailgate up manually. Now looking inside the very capacious boot of this Q7, at the minute the rear seats are folded, which means that you have the full room. You can also obviously fold down that row in front, which means that you get basically a van inside the back of this vehicle. These seats, as you can see, are electric, which means that if you've got shopping in your arms or you've got children, it means that it's really easy and really quick for you to be able to put those up. And you still get a large boot space, even with all seven seats in place. So all you have to do to fold them down is flip these headrests down and then push the buttons again and they'll retract into the floor. Everything in this car is designed to be easy, such as the boot and these electric seats, meaning that you have as little work to do as possible to use this car to its maximum capability. Now coming around here again to the side, you can also see that S-line lower bump that I was talking about earlier, which really adds to the styling of this vehicle. Now we also have very large rear doors to get into there that open out to a nearly 90 degree angle which means that getting child seats in and out is a doddle. Now having a look in the front here you can see the gloss black trim around the dashboard there is also wood trim which highlights the quality of the Q7. We've also got these supportive S-line leather seats and you can once again see that sliding and tilting panoramic sunroof there. Now coming down, these seats are fully electric, which means they also come with electric lumbar support for those longer drives, meaning you can always be comfortable in your Q7. So that completes the initial 360 degree exterior tour and brief interior tour of this Audi Q7. For more information, don't hesitate to contact us on 01785 899 417, where we can arrange a test drive for you or look at a personalized finance quote. And as an approved used vehicle, this vehicle does also qualify for 12 months warranty and 12 months roadside assistance as a minimum. 
Now looking inside this vehicle here, you can see the all electric window switches as well as the power rear door locks for children. This vehicle also comes with electrically foldable and heated door mirrors for those winter mornings. Now down here you have your automatic light switch, which means you just get in the car, you don't have to worry about whether your lights are on or not, and you just carry on driving and the car will sort it all out for you. Now here we have the flat bottomed three spoke S line multifunction steering wheel, which means all the controls for the screen in front of you and the radio control are at the touch of a button. And here we have Audi's famous virtual cockpit, currently showing the navigation screen. So to flick through these, all you have to do, as I'm doing now, is push the button on the left-hand side. And you can toggle through to look at your radio, your phone connectivity, and then you can also change the size of the dials. And then using that little scroller on the left, you can zoom in and out. So these are the controls I've just been using. So the two on the top go left and right between the different screens. The little toggle allows you to zoom in and out of the maps or to change your radio station. And the view button changes the dial size. And then on this side here, we've got our volume control. So if you push it in, it mutes it. And if you scroll it up and down, it changes the volume. And we've also got voice control and phone connectivity. This vehicle also comes fitted with cruise control, which means on those longer journeys, it's an easy experience for you in the Q7. Just take your foot off the accelerator and the car will carry on for you. Now here we have the central infotainment screen, which at the push of a button disappears. So if you don't want that in the way, you can just simply make it disappear. And then it reappears if you turn the radio on or if you need the reversing camera or when you start the vehicle. Now scrolling through here with a little wheel, you can access your navigation settings. You can access your telephone settings and you can also access your media and radio, which means with this car, it has digital audio broadcasting. So whatever radio station you feel like listening to, this car will have it. Now looking here in the car setting, you've got Audi's famous Drive Select, which means you can choose from a variety of different options depending on how you're feeling. So if you want to go for a little bit of mild off-roading in your Q7, no problem, you can put it in that and it will raise the suspension up. And you're feeling like you want to be a bit more dynamic, that's no issue. Here we have more buttons for the drive select. We have the button for the screen and we also have the climate control dials. So all you have to do is turn that and the fan speed increases. We've also got temperature cage, which goes up by 0.5 of a degree. And this vehicle does also come with front heated seats, meaning that those in the front can be comfortable whatever the weather and on those chilly winter mornings. We have a spare little cubby area down here for your keys or for anything else. And we also have a 12 volt socket. Now coming back, we have two cup holders on the left. We also have a little touch pad there, which means you can input navigation destinations. And you've also got those handy little toggles there, which can go between the screens rather than using the wheel. So there we have a volume control for your radio and sound settings. And this vehicle does come equipped with the Tiptronic automatic gearbox, which is very easy to use. And as you can see there, when you put it into reverse, you get the reversing camera, which is a very clear picture. And then looking down here, we've also got auto hold. Now these armrests in the front are slidable and they are also individual. So the passenger can have theirs at a different place to the driver. And then under here, we do also have our wireless charging pad and two USB sockets, as well as the auxiliary cable port. Now placing the armrest back down, that does complete the interior tour of this 2019 Audi Q7 Black Edition. If you have any more questions on the car or would like to arrange a test drive, please contact us today on 01785 899 417. And this vehicle does qualify for our Audi approved use scheme, which includes a minimum of 12 months warranty and a minimum of 12 months roadside assistance. Thank you for watching and we hope to see you at Stafford Audi very soon.